Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you find yourself browsing using Chrome's incognito mode, the new incognito window, uh, then just to let you know about a small change that will be rolling out soon to the browser. Now, it's all about the wording and communication regarding this disclaimer when you browse using incognito in Google Chrome. Now, just a quick recap for the purpose of today's video. The reason for this um, rewording is basically back in 2020, a lawsuit was filed against uh, Google, which Google has recently agreed to settle. And the lawsuit was all about Chrome collecting user data, uh, even when browsing uh, in the private browsing, the incognito mode, which as the name implies, should give you a more private browsing experience. Now, I don't want to get too much into the politics, but just to let you know that this disclaimer is soon going to change. And currently in the stable version, as we can see, the disclaimer reads as, now you can browse privately and other people who use this device won't see your activity. However, downloads, bookmarks and reading list items will be saved. So basically that's the disclaimer that wasn't effective enough due to this lawsuit and that's why the lawsuit was filed as an example. Now, if we head over to Chrome Canary version 122, which is the latest preview version, and we head to the same incognito mode private browsing window, yeah, we can see now that the disclaimer has been changed. Although the last sentence is basically exactly the same, the first two are slightly changed and the wording and communication are different. It says others who use this device won't see your activity, so you can browse more privately. This won't change how data is collected by websites you visit and the services they use, including Google. Downloads, bookmarks, and reading list items will be saved. So that's basically how it's been changed uh, to make everybody happy. And I just wanted to put it out there in case you do see this change. And this is currently in Chrome Canary 122. So I would say in the next um, two or three versions of Google Chrome, this could roll out and this disclaimer and the wording and communication uh, will be changed and although the wording has been changed basically private browsing nothing has changed with functionality everything will operate as it did even though the disclaimer has been changed how it currently is over in the stable version so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one